Right guys, so to make our sugar syrup, all we're going to need to do is put our heat on. And in here we've got 300 ml of water. That's going to go straight into the pan. To that I'm going to take half a lemon and squeeze that in. Make sure I've got all of that in there. half going straight in and then I've got 300 grams of unrefined caster sugar and all we're going to do is boil that up until we get a lovely syrup so I'm just going to leave this on so you guys can see what it should look like at the end Okay, so the first thing you want to do is boil the pan. In here I've just got butter. It's around 200 grams of butter. I'm just going to oil the entire thing. And just leave that to one side. And then here we've got our phyllo pastry. And all I'm going to do is carefully roll this out. This was actually in the freezer, so it's a little bit crumbly. So I'm just going to roll out one sheet at a time. I'm going to take two sheets, carefully unroll and just leave the rest to one side. Don't worry if it's cracked because you can save it, it's not a problem. So in here we're literally just going to take our butter and cover. Just like that. And then we're going to take our pistachios. And then a few of the mint, the, um, the rose petals. Just a few. So, and then we're going to use this which is like a small, thin tube, I don't know how to describe it. It was off a curtain rail. <laughs> and we're just going to roll this as carefully as you can. And when you get to this bit here, we're literally, oh, it's slightly torn, don't worry too much if it's torn. And take that one off for a minute. When you get to this bit, you're literally just going to crinkle it up like that, pull it off and we're going to place it straight into the tray, just like that. When it's in the tray, you're just going to brush a load of butter over the top. And we're going to repeat.
So this is now gonna go into the oven for 20 minutes until it's golden brown at 180. Okay, so the baklava's out of the um, oven. They're lovely and crispy, if you can see all the way through lovely and crispy so what we're going to do now is just cut them into fours so i'm just going to take one let's cut down the middle i'm just going to show you what it looks like in the middle super lovely and crispy So to that, this is the syrup, and we're just going to pour the syrup all over and let that soak up. So to decorate, all we're going to do is take some of the pistachio, just take a little spoonful of this stuff and place a little bit on top of each segment, just like that. And that's it. And then finally we're just going to take a little bit of the rose petal and just put a small bit on top of each one. And there you have it guys, my rose pistachio baklava. Super easy to make and made in less than 25 minutes, I'd say, by the time I was finished. And you have to just let these rest for a minimum of four hours, but preferably overnight. And there you have it. So let's try these guys out. So here we go. We've got a lovely, crunchy, crunchy, crunchy all the way through. Amazing. Guys, I hope you love this recipe. These are incredible. Enjoy, guys. And tune in next week for another video. Mm -mm -mm -mm.